how successful people read, um, leaders are readers. Hi, this is Diane Klein. I'm actually going to do this video today. Um, my video is going to be based on the book club we had this morning. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about two points that I took out of um, the book club that were jumping out at me from the first and second chapter that we were discussing on the book club today. And the book we're reading right now is How Successful People Learn How to How Well How Successful People Read and Learn How to How to Read uh, Like the Successful People Do by John C. Maxwell. And this morning, as we were discussing, the two things that I had written down here was the, some of the biggest things. I'll talk more about other ones, but learn from every experience is a very good one. You know we've been talking before about learning from your failures and getting up and keeping going, but something that jumped out at me was don't sit on your successes. Like if you have success, don't sit on it. Learn from it and keep going and just be teachable at all times. Never ever stop being teachable because if you stop being teachable, then you're not going to learn anything else. And that was some great, great point, points shared this morning also on the club. And I'm not going to be able to, I'm just doing a two to three minute video here. I'm not going to be able to come on board and, and give you every little uh, detail that we discussed. But you can join us every Wednesday. We have book club dial in. It's a number that you dial in. And just watch my Facebook wall and you'll see that on Wednesdays I'm going to put up this banner uh, of the number that you need to dial in. But the second point was remove all distractions. And I give you little points of how to do that make time to be focused in your thinking and there's all these very important points that you have to follow because if you're not a big thinker then you just you just go stale then you just sit where you are but if you are a big thinker then that's where it's at so um i loved how he shared that one point in the book um let me see if i can remember how it goes but he shared about something little happens and the little thinker blows it all out of proportion whereas the big thinker thinks long term like how can this benefit me now like one of the things that um that kind of was shared on this morning was if you got a ticket if you get let's say you get a speeding ticket or a parking ticket or something a small mind small thinkers are going to be raving and ranting and mad at this ticket you know and just blowing it out of proportion it's just a ticket and then the big thinker is gonna say okay i learned next time i have i know i'm not supposed to park here this is not a parking zone i have to look around and i have to make sure there's no signs of what i do i'm gonna learn from my stake and i'm gonna take it from there so there you go that's just a little example to become a successful leader if you're looking for something to work from home and you're striving to become better or you're looking for something to become debt free click the link at the bottom we teach people how to sell on ebay and amazon and if you love to shop we'll teach you genesis okay bye for now